back to Stellaris, the Ancient Relics DLC, and I'm very excited to see what's gonna happen with the with the Irration archaeological site. It's, it's probably gonna be a huge mess. So let's get this party rolling. Let's see. The aliens are reaching out. Ooh, who are you? <gasps> Sure, why not? I mean, we can definitely do some dealings. Let's see. Okay, so we're in Federation. Who are you? Oh, there we go. So, the Great Rehar Union. Oh, the way over here, okay. Oh, sure, no, I, I want your planet. Show me to your planet. No. Oh, there's one of the things that we're looking for. That's nice to know. Uh, there we go. Okay. It's a little bit clunky here. There's probably a best way to doing this, and I don't know how to do it. Oh, there we go. Ooh. What can we sell? I don't want to risk that. Let's see, we can sell some of that, some of that. Uh, some of that, yeah. Okay, so let's see. Whoop. Nice, yes, of course. Wow, that's 69. That's huge. And let's see. What do we need right now? Process 10 food. Base production. One of these actually would be very nice. Also the commercial one. Let's, let's start with the fast food chain. They will do the rest. Okay. Sounds fair? Alright. <laughs> because I'm thinking that. Yeah, we should be doing the commercial form next. Okay. Alright. Do we have production targets? Oh, yes, we do. Let's, let's pump that up. I'm, I'm thinking that we need to do some. I, I don't know. I don't know what we need to do to to get a mineral or, or food or something that we can start pumping in, in big numbers to sell. Which also reminds me, yeah, we have slave market. Nice. <laughs> what stage your planet is missing? Who's selling these? And why? Well, what will you sell them? I mean, I don't mind. Bring them over. So let's, bring them here. Let's, let's bring them all there. Interesting. So... That's right now, okay. So yeah, that's right, that's right. Pex, but... If everything is right here... Huh! Okay. So that's... That's pretty interesting. I don't know why we can buy machines. I wasn't even aware that you could buy robots. That's great to know. That's very good to know, actually. And we cannot build the robot assembly thingy. Because not yet. Not yet, not yet. But soon. Soon enough. Also, also... Oh, we don't have any miners here. That's interesting. So we're not even exploiting that. Nice. It's good to know. It's good to know. Let's see, how are we doing? 20% just... well, for one clue we're doing fine. I 
Okay, let's say we're doing fine. Upgrade building, upgrade building. Even if we're losing... Another um, bleeding edge technology discovered. Even if we're, we're not getting the outer building yet. Resource yeah. scan complete. Let's see. Look at that, it's, it's just following us. Let's do it. Oof. It's gonna be interesting. <laughs> so you're done? Okay. I don't think there's anything else to research nearby. Oh yeah. We're going that way. Then... Going back home. So we start researching. Another help bleeding edge technology discovered. Oof, 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 oof. This is good. This is so good. Oh, what now? Call it event. Yeah, let's, let's do that because eventually we're gonna start growing. I don't care for the penalty at this point. I just don't care anymore. We're just gonna do our stuff, and then we're gonna kick everyone's ass. Nice. Ah, there we go. That's 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 exactly what I'm looking for. That's just exactly what I'm looking for. Look at that. It's gonna be 17 minerals, three rare crystals, three energy. We already have five molds. Oh, because we already have. Ah, that's the reason why it wasn't showing up, wasn't it? Yep. Because we already had the the base there. Nice. Kinda. Weirdly implemented, but okay, that's good to know. Um, I need some, some, actually, I, I, I don't know, I don't know how that would work out. That, that's, that's a little bit weird. Because it, it just confused me. Even though I saw the name, I'm like, okay, so it has to be inside or, or territory. But, um, yeah, that, that, was, that was weird. What? What? Oh, okay. Okay. Alrighty then. Let's see. Uh, for how much can we sell the moats? Oh, that's some nice cash. Yeah, that's some that's some very nice cash. Yeah, let's let's just let's just destabilize the market for now. Let's see. Let's see what the hell we can do. Okay, so we have that. Uh, we need the forum. Okay, so that, that that's that's stabilized right now. Nice. Okay, and that's gonna pay itself. Like that's that's gonna pay itself so fast. So so fast. Ooh, that's not good. Uh, what? Fleet manager. Let's see what the hell's going on here. Uh, what? Okay, hold on a second. Let me just remove this. Aha, uh -huh. so that's that. And the hell? What? So you have ten? And, and okay, and this is our fleet. If I'm not mistaken, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure what the hell's going on here. Uh, okay. Okay, there we go. Apparently, it just it just freaked out for a little bit. That's good. Oh, look at that! We have a commander, and I wasn't even aware. Wait, 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 wait. Stuff's going on. Let's see, tremors. The echoes inside a single warm like creature of gargantuan proportions is responsible for the tunnels dug or rather eaten throughout through the crust of Eros 5. The process is slowing down most likely because the giant worm is slowly starving. It is responsible for the dead vegetation once it fed by burrowing close to the surface and expelling an enzyme that broke down organic matter, which seeped into the soil to nourish the beast. The worm is not indigenous to Eras 5, 
And as yet, we have no clue how to do the planet. I am pretty sure we're gonna find some really creepy things. Like creepy. Super creepy. But, hey, whatever, man. <laughs> whatever. Almost done? Okay. Then go there. Oh, wow. that, okay, that's gonna take a while. Ready, ready, okay, all right, all right. That was fine. Uh, how much 20% is going to the Federation? Okay, uh, all right. I don't know, do, do migration treaties affect us? For example, if, let's say, for example, that um, someone else is having a migration treaty and they they have a migration treaty with us, do we get people from their empire, regardless of which race they are, or something like that? That would be something interesting to check. That would be something very interesting, now that I think about it. I'm not even sure how to... Now that, that it will make sense to get people from other empires into ours because of a treaty from a third party I can see that happening. Yeah, definitely. It's still interesting to ask that. To see if, if that is how it works, or, or if it works like that or not. My man. Those rolls? Mm -mm. Not gonna work. Oh, you need, uh, f you need a six clear on the die. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. I, I was wondering... I was wondering if, if, if he needed more. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Three. Oof. We need to start doing more research. But in order to do that, we need to get more people. Which is not happening, obviously. Uh, 117 for 2263. I think that's small. To be quite honest, I think that's a very small amount of people. Oh, there's more have some Oh, yeah. Wait, isn't here where the... Wait a second. Yeah, this is where the... Ooh! Oof! Wow. Holy crap. Technicians. Versus 5.2. Should I? I should. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that I could build before that, but from what I'm seeing, that's probably going to be the priority. Uh, relics. Do we? No, we don't have enough. I wonder what happens when, when you do this. Like, what is it that you get from that? Also, can you have more than six relics? I don't know. It's a good question. Do I get relics if, if I defeat another Empire? Or if I absorb it, rather? Do not like chill out. Like, wow. I love it that people tune their bikes so they make more noise. It's like people that tune their Hondas to make more noise. Why do you do that? Seriously, don't. Really don't. It's very annoying. Like, it's like a giant mosquito <laughs> on the streets. It's like, what? And it's just going out like maybe. 20 or 30 miles. Uh, seen it. I've seen it way too many times here. Tijuana. Just why? Research what do you even bother? We did it. Nice. The crew of the ISS Explorer has managed to collect a small group of Utlorans from the icy surface of Srudama Secundus. These white free omnivores, omnivores wrap themselves into tight balls and roll across the moon's snowfields at astonishing speeds. One animal was clocked at over 80 kilometers per hour. That's pretty fast. This I aided in their detection since the passage of the rolling forms kicks up huge plumes of swirling snow. Yep, sounds about right. Sounds like something that would definitely give them away. I'm a bit scared by the fact that you have not picked here. It's making me think that there's something creepy there. Like super creepy. Shh, like, pff. no, but seriously, I'm, I'm I'm really thinking that there's something very creepy there. Let's see, that's more station. It's, it's Tokyo. 
There we go. Should be good to go. Hmm. So what do I do? I'm seriously thinking that I should be pushing for um, what to call for more robots. But I don't want to be buying them. I don't know if that makes sense. I don't want to be buying more robots. I would rather produce them. It's just that I'm a little bit too anxious to get ahead of everyone else. I mean, I already am. With the damn ship. It's just stupid. Stupid and... And, you know... Yeah, all that. Construction complete. Let's finish this construction queue. Okay. I think almost... All the planets are finishing up. Yep. Scientist? Nice. Oh, that's a genius one. I sh I was thinking of moving her elsewhere, but now it's okay. Uh, following the period of course support for Cena Justice Foundation, the Kalasan Republic has failed and raised the Epsilon Felix. Okay. Kalasan. Do you like it? Myself. Oh, it's just it's you. You will you mind self like crawling somewhere else? What the hell is that? What the hell does that even mean? Xenophile. <laughs> Poor friction, slavery policy, xenophilia, Georgian tyrants. Uh oh. <laughs> or else have 19 claims on them. Wow. I'm I, I'm actually very interested in doing that. I'm gonna think about it. Just because I could push all, oh, but that's the thing. Like they have. Okay, so let's let's hold up for a second. Okay, so this is one of their allies. This is. Yeah, no, this is not a threat. Come on. That is not a threat at all. And the Valdari Empire. Ooh. I'm not sure. I wanna. I mean, technically, there, there's a lot of us against a lot of them, right? Damn it! It sounds, it sounds like something very juicy, but I'm thinking that I, I, I first need to stabilize my space. Although, why the hell not? You know what? Let's let me first. <sighs> let me just first. Let's see, claims. Hold on a second. Scrap. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take it first. So screw you. Hmm. Taking that, taking that. Why, why is it so cheap? Yeah, I don't need that. But that would be great to have. So! Off all that. Let's see, can we declare war yet? For how long? Two more years. <laughs> Two more years to build up. Kinda. You know, that's the thing. I wanna build up, but I don't have the efficient research management that I need. Now, here's another problem. I'm seeing another problem here, so I ha I'm gonna have to, to control that problem from from Shakarun to Nokam because I'm, I'm seeing that that's gonna be an issue. Like a real issue with piracy and all that. So let's, 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 let's and let that finish up. Now, let's see, come on. Nice. 
Now, if, if you're wondering, like, why are you wasting your resources? Your consumer goods don't matter. We're just waiting for that, for that upgrade. Shouldn't take that long, that's what I'm hoping for. And I'm really hoping for that, but... Wow, 45! <laughs> See? Mad money. What do we need the other stuff for? As a matter of fact... Wow, that's growing very fast. Okay. I'm liking that. Alright. We're gonna end up the episode here. I'm... We're gonna go to war with the Phoenix Collision. That's that's a def that's definitely gonna happen. Um, against the Kalasan Republic, not yet. Also, I forgot that the Forerunners are here, and I'm a kind of a little bit just like I don't want to mess with them. I mean, actually, they're very close to each other. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna do the War in Heaven thing. Hope not. But anyway. So that's it for this episode. Thank you very much for tuning in. Remember, if you have comments or questions, leave them down in the comment section below. Like, share, and subscribe if you haven't done so. Thank you very much for tuning in, and have a good one.